Jesus Reigns TV, impacting, dominating, colonizing nations with the gospel of Jesus Christ. The prayer of a righteous man prevails. You're watching Faith Time with Yam Keller Joseph, a servant of God in our time. Connect in faith. The Bible says the thief cometh not but to kill, to steal, and to destroy. Yet I've come that you have life and have it in abundance. Jesus came so that we have life. Jesus came so that we can live a life in abundance. The devil's strategy is simply to make life difficult for us. Right now, family, I want you to understand that many are oppressed by the enemy through the mind. The Bible says, brethren, I beseech you by the message of God that you offer your bodies as living sacrifices, holy and pleasant unto the Lord. It says, then, then be, not, be not conformed to the standard of the world, but be therefore transformed by the renewing of the mind. The enemy knows that the mind, it is the key to transformation. The mind, it is the key to worship. As long as our worship is not the worship from the mind, then it becomes ineffective. Many, the enemy comes and oppress their minds through different kinds of spirit and one of those spirits is called depression. Depression simply comes to exalt your problems above your God. It tells you that God is smaller and your problems are bigger, but faith tells you that God is bigger and your problems are small. It is impossible to believe under depression. It is impossible to stay in faith when you are depressed because the enemy comes and he exalts everything that you're going through and he tells you that you can't come out of that situation but i want you to become like joshua and caleb in the midst of all doubts in the midst when everybody say it is normal joshua and caleb said we will re we will believe the report of the lord i want you to understand that it is all about deciding against all what is happening and say i want to believe god that i wasn't created like this i'm gonna not i'm not gonna stay like this i'm gonna bind every spirit of depression i'm gonna bind every mental oppressing spirit that is trying to suppress me suppress my life suppress my soul and i'm going to rise out of this mad of depression and i'm going to overcome in the name of jesus you can overcome everything is a spirit and you are a spirit you can overcome through the blood of Jesus Christ. I want to pray for you as I pray for you. I believe that God is going to do great things. It's going to break the cause of depression over your life. The Bible is clear that abundant peace belongs to them that trust the Lord. If you trust God, you will live in abundant peace. Family, it's not about us being in control. It's about Christ being in control through us. So you have to give him his place. And when you give him his place, he's going to take over. I believe right now, many of you, as I'm talking to you, depression is being broken. The stronghold of mental spirits, mental oppressing spirits are right now being broken. If you're suffering with that kind of a spirit right now, I want you to lift your hands towards me. As I'm praying for you, I can see the chains of depression are going to be broken right now. Let's begin to lift up your hands towards me right now. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, I decree and I declare by the blood of Jesus Christ by the power of the Holy Spirit I decree right now in the mighty name of Jesus the Christ the Son of the Living God I rebuke every spirit of depression mental oppressing spirit spirits that oppresses the mind spirit that causes every kind of misfortune spirit that causes the exaltation of problems above the solution i break it from the mind every spirit be broken from the mind be broken from the brain be broken from the eyes be broken from the nose be broken from all the five senses of their bodies in the blood of jesus i break depression from their blood i declare if it's a generational curse let it be broken 
in the name of Jesus Christ. What affected their mother, their father will not affect them. Father, everybody that dies by depression in their families, I bring it unto a stop. I break it in the name of Jesus. I break it in the name of Jesus. They receive your deliverance. Deliverance from depression. Your spirit of depression be broken. 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 In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I declare right now, I can see the cords of depression being broken over you. I can see the power of depression being broken over your life. I can see the light of Jesus. I can see it shining over you. I can see it in the blood of Jesus Christ. You are free. 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 You are free in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name, you are free from the manipulation of darkness. You are free from the voices of the enemy that are speaking in your ears. I declare only God shall speak through you. In Jesus' mighty name, depression is broken. You are free. You are free. Right now, every mental spirit, mental oppressing demons are broken right now by the blood of Jesus Christ. I see somebody is free. Those with suicidal thoughts, you are free from those suicidal thoughts. I declare that you are free in the name of Jesus. You are delivered in the name of Yeshua HaMashiach. It is done. It is done. It is done. In Jesus' name, wherever they bind your life, I set you free by the blood of Jesus. Remember, by his stripes, you are healed. You are delivered from every kind of a situation. So believe and continue to have faith. I believe that what God has begun, God is going to finish it up. So right now, I want you to tell us, writing on the details uh, that are on the screen and email and tell us, what God is doing and tell us your testimony. Many of you have been delivered already. I believe that a miracle has taken place in your life. So God bless you. Shalom. Until I see you next time. Amen. That God has sent me on an assignment and God has sent me for a specific prophetic visitation that I may go to pray and intercede from Robben Island in South Africa. Thank you for watching Jesus Reigns TV. I believe that you are blessed by the testimonies, the prophecies, the teachings that you keep receiving into this channel. Family, I believe that God is doing great things all over the world and your life is also being transformed and Jesus is reigning over your life. The prophecies keep coming to pass each and every hour. Testimonies are coming and many people's lives are being transformed by the messages that are being taken out of this channel. I believe that God is only just beginning and the best is yet to come. I want to encourage you never, never to forget to become a partner with Jesus Reigns TV by making sure that you become part of the partner's role using the details that are on the screen right now. You can send the email and request to become a partner of Jesus Reigns TV and you will receive an email which will give you the partnership form. I believe that God wants us to be partners into taking the gospel all over the world. I say each and every one of us us is a product of somebody else's partnership of somebody's offering for us to receive the gospel so you can also save another soul by partnering with the gospel so that the gospel can go all over the world. Now I want to give you this opportunity. As you have heard me preaching the word of God, you say, man of God, I've heard you prophesying. I've heard you uh, teaching the word of God. And I see the testimonies as well and what God is doing. But the problem is that me, myself, I don't know Jesus. I don't have a relationship with Jesus. And I've never met Jesus Christ. So I want to lead you into this prayer of salvation. And I believe that the Bible says we believe in our hearts, confess with our mouths, and we are saved. And as you make this prayer, God is going to change your life and God is going to transform you. So just make this prayer after me. So Lord Jesus, today I believe that you are the Son of God. You rose and you died and rose again. And I believe that in your way, I am saved. I believe that you are the King 
over my life and the Lord of my life in Jesus name as you made this prayer I believe that Jesus has entered your heart symbol the Bible say believing in our hearts confessing with our mouth that Jesus is the Lord and we are saved so right now you are saved and I want you to continue living according to the Word of God the Bible said the Word of God is a show word of prophecy so as you receive the Word of God your life is gonna be changed so thank you for watching my name is Yamkela Joseph I believe the next time I see you it will be in your own city in your own town God bless you I love you so much Shalom Shalom